face, baby. <laughs> hey, y'all. Okay, so I've completely flat ironed and blow dried my whole entire head, as you can very well see. Um, my first time blow drying and flat ironing the whole head after two years and two months of being natural. Yes. And boy, was this a mission. I tell y'all, like three hours uh, to do this whole thing. Like, oh. Lord, next time I'll leave it to the professionals. But I did just want to see like how my hair looks, you know, um, you know, straighter, you know, than you know, curly. I just wanted to see how it looks. So these are the results that I've got um, after two years of two years and three months of being natural. So the hair is not a completely bone straight, but you can see my growth. Hold on, let me remove my glasses. Hopefully my face will look too crazy because, like I said, I've been here for three hours. Okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can see my growth. I am so super proud of my hair. So ladies, if you're out there wanting to go natural and you're just not sure, just go for it. Just go for it. If you're already wearing wigs and weaves, just go forward. Cover it up. Make sure you take care of your hair underneath and just go for it because I am so pleased with the results and the growth that I have gotten with my hair. Like, I am so pleased. Like, my bangs have not been this long. <laughs> These are my, this is like the front portion. My bangs have not been this long since like ninth grade, okay? And I am way past ninth grade, okay? <laughs> but they are just, it's just so much growth. There's a little bit of breakage here, but that's because um, I had heat damage from almost two years ago. Um, really bad heat damage um, when I had a sew in and I just kept flat iron, flat iron on a, on a really high temperature. So it's a little breakage there, but it is catching, it's starting to catch up. Um, but yeah, we're still got to work on that part, but I am just really pleased with the growth I've gotten in these past two years. Like I said, it's not a full on flat iron, really a bone straight, you know, look because I did it myself and you know, it's my first time flat iron blow dry my hair in two years, but you know, this is what I've gotten so far and I'm, I'm just so pleased. Um, let me go ahead and turn around so you guys can see what's going on in the bizac. Um, hopefully you can see all that. But yeah, just a good amount of growth. I am very pleased, very, very pleased with my hair growth in the past two years. I'm just amazed. I am absolutely amazed. Now, it looks like my the front part of my hair here isn't as long as the rest, but it's okay. It will catch up. And I noticed the left side bang isn't as long as this side here. Um, but it will catch up. And then this... Um, I'm not sure why this is shorter. I'm sure it has something to do with some damaging, something I did in the past, and it's just taking a little time to catch up. But it's okay, you know, it, it's okay. It will catch up because I am taking a lot of care to my hair, a lot more, a lot better care than I have in the past few years. Um, but yeah, guys, check it out. Like, I'm super excited. Like, it has so much, um, sorry to keep shaking my head. It has so much body and so much growth and so much, it's like super thick and it's very healthy. Uh, I'm just pleased. It's a little heavy now because after I did that original filming that you guys saw earlier in this clip, I deep conditioned, washed my hair, and I put it back into the plaits for like two days. But I think I added a little bit too much of the blue magic because my hair is like super oily right now. Um, but yeah, let me just let you know what I've been washing and blow drying my hair well washing my hair with when I do um, do my deep conditioning thingy like I don't even know how to like touch it now I don't even know how to like screw with it <laughs> but anywho um, this is what I've been using when I shampoo I use the L'Oreal's Ever Curl um, it has no sulfate in it which is a really really good shampoo um, I actually started using this about a year ago when I was living with that roommate girl I was I kind of tell you guys about from time to time um, but yeah it's a really good shampoo and if you're looking for something with no sulfate this is the way to go normally they have bigger containers but I can only find this one at my local Walmart so and I think it's like $5. It's a little pricey for a shampoo, but it's good and it works really well on curly hair. I haven't really found another non-sulfate um, shampoo that works as good as this one, but I'm, you know, I'm still searching. But again, I use the L'Oreal's Ever Curl. It works wonders on our hair um, and also no sulfate. And I deep condition with this. Well, usually I try to deep condition with any conditioner, but lately I've been trying to use the matching conditioner with the shampoo just to give it more of a... I guess a complete, um, a complete, you know, complete something, <laughs> you know, try to keep everything together instead of using like suave conditioner and then L'Oreal's, you know, shampoo. Um, but yeah, this is the conditioner that I use and I put the conditioner in my head. I, you know, do the whole wash, 
wash, wash, rinse, and then I just put it back in my hair and I let it sit in my hair for two to three to four to five, six hours. But this time around, I only let it sit in my hair for about two and a half hours to three hours because I had something to do the next day and I couldn't just like, you know, wake up the next morning with my hair kind of damp like I normally would do when I'm deep conditioning. Um, but yeah, so this time around, I put this in my hair and let it sit for two to three hours and it worked really well. Um, getting on to how I turn it into this, um, I did use the Tresme, um, what is this one, uh, the, the heat protectant, my, actually my first time using this um, thingy, so I'm really hoping that my curls do bounce back um, after everything that I've done here, not not saying that it's because it's, it's not like a, a bone straight look, but it's a lot straighter than it has been in two years, so I'm really hoping this helped quite a bit, and I didn't um, do any type of heat damage, but this is what I use to you know create this fabulosity that you see here and um, also my products that I used to flat iron and blow dry was my favorite new me product had it for like two years now really like this flat iron a lot and then I picked up this from my local Walmart um, it's red by kiss um, and this one is the one with the three different nozzle heads like it has like this to put on and then you have the brush and then there's another wide tooth comb one um, but that's about it. I did try the flat iron comb chase method, but since my hair has not been flat ironed in years, it didn't really lay as flat as or as straight as you know other YouTube videos. Um, but like I said, I haven't done this in two, three years. It's my first time doing it, um, and I did it myself. So, but yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a little close up and let you know what's going on with the hair. And if you're considering going natural, just go forward. How many minutes have I wasted? Okay, um, just go for it because it's. I am just really, really pleased with the outcome of my hair and how much growth I have gotten just in two years just two years after me thinking oh I just spit all over the screen I'm sorry guys after me thinking like oh no my hair just doesn't grow um it just doesn't grow with chemicals like uh, my hair was the type of hair that just it didn't do well with chemicals but ever since I put those chemicals behind me my hair has been as thick as it used to be as a child like and I'm just super excited and you know I'm very excited so yeah again this is just two years two years two months of natural um, I can't really pull it from the back, but as you guys see, it's it has it had a little length back there. You know what I'm saying? I got a little length. Got a little length back there. But yeah, I'm really, really excited. Let's see. If I had to pull it in a pony. Let's see what I'm working with when I pull it in a pony. Yes, good. Oh, yes, good. Um, but anyway, that was it. I just wanted to show you guys what I was working with oh show you what I'm working with <laughs> um but yeah that that's it I just wanted to really show you guys um yeah <laughs> just really want to show you guys what's going on up under you know all my wigs and weaves and stuff and this this is what it is it's healthy natural hair I don't know the inches that it is but it's it's longer than when I do this I don't have my measuring tape on me right now so I'm not going to be like everybody else's video like um, but yeah, it is what it is. You can kind of gauge from, you know, just looking at the video and seeing. Oh, y'all like that? <laughs> seeing where I'm at. <laughs> but yeah, let me stop. I gotta go to bed. I have been up. I got stuff to do tomorrow. I got classes and I have been way up for way too late. So, this is Thanks for watching, guys. And hey, remember, if you think about going natural, just go for it. Go for it. It's totally worth it. Your hair will be much healthier. You'll be much healthier. And... I guarantee you'll be much happier because I am totally pleased with my outcome. So, alright, happy journeys. Talk to y'all soon. Bye.